moving on to the next most important section and that's the expected questions from the environment section now based on the contemporary phenomena for the last five papers at least so last past two and a half years we have seen a lot of questions coming from the section on environment and education which are contemporary in nature now under education we have already covered those when it comes to environment uh, air pollution in light of the delhi and later chennai air pollution two topics become very very important those are suffer and eqi the air quality index now there could be simple questions like what are the parameters under which we have the eqi index what are the basic categories what are the color codings for those categories so those are kind of basic questions basic frame questions that are possible from the air pollution based on the june 2019 paper two topics become exceptionally important those are sustainable development goals and millennium development goals millennium development goals we have covered separately in one of the lectures sustainable development goals goal 6 becomes very important which focuses on sanitation drive we also have jal jeevan abhiyan which talks about providing piped water supply to all the households by 2024 so again a very very important aspect the next is the national ambient air quality uh, so that's again a standard where we look on to the various 12 parameters that are there the clean air initiative which is started in bangalore is again important design disaster management in light of the global warming you have numerous uh, cyclonic disturbances numerous uh, uh, volcanic activities going on across the globe and therefore disaster risk reduction is one of the very important concepts sendai framework is very important recently we have taken one of the question uh, one of the classes on people environment and development where we have discussed 12 20 important questions from this section on people environment and development so go through that very very important for this examination the next is single use plastic so single use plastic the size becomes important so it's less than 50 microns uh, is considered under single use so uh, whatever plastic goes into the body of animals and could affect the intestinal and the gastrointestinal system of the animal are considered unsafe and therefore uh, single use plastic in india you have the usage that has jumped up in uh, billions so you have a very high usage that has registered over the years and therefore there is an urgent need to work on plastic management now how it can go we are trying to turn plastic into uh, bitumen which could be used for road construction which could be used with asphalt so those are some of the ways under plastic waste management uh, has been enhanced and then better quality plastic we can go for recycling we are also moving towards alternative ways uh, where cardboard or uh, the acranut uh, trees could be used uh, for as a replacement of plastics fall army worm now this is a pest infestation that has affected a lot of species mainly in telangana and the pradesh and southern states this is an infestation which affects most of the plant species most of the agricultural species we could say and is highly dangerous so there is an immediate need to control the spread of uh, diseases like these specifically in the plants because it could damage out a huge chunk of agricultural produce that is being given so controlling these species is again important air conditioning now recently there has been a lot of debates about air conditioning we have rising amount of carbon dioxide emissions that have been seen and these rising amount of air, uh, carbon dioxide emissions have been linked in the last seven decades with the higher use of air conditioning systems that have been seen now this has definitely impacted warming of the earth on the contrary we are talking about a global nuclear winter if uh india and pak uh, come into a war and there is 250 warheads that are used by the country the temperature could drop down to 2.5 degree celsius which is converting the uh, the country and the globe into a nuclear winter holocaust so that's a uh, positive side of it then you have greta thunberg highly in news these days so she is a swedish teenager who is looking for campaigning and um, working around the issues of environment three of her books very very important no one is too small to make a difference 
Our house is on fire and scenes from the heart are some of her basic works which are uh, being considered on the environmental front. She was one of the nominees for the Nobel Peace Prize. The next is Earth Alliance. Now this is a new initiative started by Hollywood actor DiCaprio along with a billionaire Baron Sheet. Uh, the idea is to bring in more awareness about the issue of climate change and global warming. Uh, the COP25 uh, ha held in Madrid is again important. So that's uh, that's one of the uh, conference of parties which would be held in the month of December 2019. So again, very, very important. India, Kanpur in Uttar Pradesh has been ranked as one of the most polluted cities in the world where the particulate matter uh, 2.5 the concentration is 17 times higher than the WHO limits, which are 10 micrograms per meter cube. So a very, very significant amount of higher particulate matter 2.5 that has been seen in Ka uh, Kanpur. Alino and Danina, in light of the global change, in light of the sudden monsoon phenomena that are seen, these two concepts become very, very important. General concepts, but yes, they are important from your examination point of view this year. We have covered separate lecture on that, so you can just go back and check out the lecture. The next is Colombo Declaration. Now, this declaration is on sustainable nitrogen management. The idea is to half the nitrogen waste by 2030. A campaign for nitrogen for life has been started and bringing in much more technical support from international nitrogen management systems is again important. Uh, this conference or this declaration was attended by 30 uh, countries across the globe and this was held in Nairobi, Kenya uh, in the month of March 2019. Very, very important development. In India, we are talking about the Snow Leopards Population Assessment Program. Now, this aims to check out the very marginal population, which is just 400 to 700 Snow Leopards spread in the region of Jammu Kashmir, Ladakh, Uttarakhand, Sikkim, Arunachal. So, how uh, this initiative has started is with the world's Snow Leopards Initiative and aims to assess the, um, the population of these Snow Leopards. Recently, a very good news indeed was the size of the ozone hole has reduced. Now, it was first found in 1985 and in 2006, we said it was nearly 10.3 million square miles. However, recently it has reduced to 3.6 million square miles. So, significant reduction has been seen. So, whatever we are trying to do on the environmental front, specifically for curbing and the ozone, where we are talking about controlling the CFCs, the chlorofluorocarbons into the atmosphere is a really, really important step that we need to understand. Next, another important aspect is a deep carbon observatory. This is a global research program which aims to outreach the issues of carbon on the earth and it's believed that if we go into the mental nearly 600 or 700 meters deep we have ultra deep diamonds that have been found so the organic material which is present in the earth's interior is providing geochemical signatures for the same we are also talking about the earth carbon the carbon present in the mental and the core so assessing that understanding the outreach program where the carbon's role on the earth could be assessed is a very important aspect of this deep carbon observatory very very important the next is eco-friendly crackers. Now, with the festive season over, you had barium nitrate, which is used in most of the crackers and is one of the severe pollutants. When we say eco-friendly uh, crackers, this barium nitrate is replaced by potassium nitrate. Also, the proportion of nitrogen and sulfur emissions into the atmosphere has been reduced significantly by 30 to 35 percent. You have a lot of uh, air particles or particulate emissions going into the atmosphere which are being significantly reduced in this case. So those are some of the key aspects here. Green company certification is again important because this is a rating that provides the industrial units for environmental sustainable practices. India has uh, started with the first car uh, garbage cafe. Now, this has been started in Ambikapur in North Chhattisgarh. The idea is the people who are picking up garbage, if they give half a kg of garbage, they, they can get food in lieu to that. So, indeed, a very innovative aspect, a very good development, we could say. And the last but the most important is the 
Okjokul glacier now this glacier lies in Iceland it has been totally vanished off because of the climate change last year in May there was a bronze statue that was put up there showing the concentration of carbon dioxide to 415 ppm and that has vanished off that statue has vanished off and that glacier has totally melted so indeed it's a very major concern showing that the glaciers are sink, uh, shrinking Switzerland has recorded a 10% decline in the glacier so again this topic becomes very very important from your exam examination perspective we will be bringing many more important sections for you so practice on these topics very very carefully have a good day ahead